Well, look out, pinup girls. Some local college guys are now taking off their clothes. They're bearing it all, or almost all, in a racy campus calendar. Fox 8 News reporter Kathy Cronenberger takes us to Ohio State University for a peek. I feel like a piece of meat sometimes. Yeah. <laughs> They walk the Ohio State University campus dressed like any other students, only... There you are. Yes. <laughs> These Buckeyes are best known for being nearly buck naked. Mr. June right here. Sexy, it hurts. They're part of the campus men calendar, and all four of these studs are from Northeast Ohio. My name is Brian Sam. I'm from Solon, Ohio. I'm John Watterson. I'm from Hudson, Ohio. This is my third year here at Ohio State. Hi, my name's Vince Meadow. I'm a sophomore at Ohio State University. My name's Jay Downing. I'm from Strongsville, Ohio. Mr. August graduated from St. Ed's. Now, is this weird? Because you're showing your bottom here. <laughs> Uh, it was weird for me at first. Uh, I didn't plan on uh, having a picture with, uh, you know, with my rear end hanging out. Jay, Jay, Jay's got the plumber shot. Mm -hmm. You know, I've had some comments made about, you know, uh, I have the plumber profile. And Westlake grad Mr. January is covered only by a strategically placed stuffed animal. That's your girlfriend's teddy bear? Or ex -girlfriend? hey, ex-girlfriend's teddy bear. I have it now because she kind of didn't want it back after, uh... <laughs> I mean, yeah, I can kind of understand. She's like, what did you use it for? I'm like, it's my underwear. It's like, it's not the same anymore now. <laughs> They're not professional models, just average guys with nice bods. We try to keep away from uh, uh, Grandma Kaiser for as long as possible. But uh, when she saw it, she, was, uh, she gave the two thumbs up. And like female models, they want to be respected for more than their good looks pre-med economics major. I'm also Mr. March and I uh, happen to be running for the vice president of the second largest undergraduate student government in the nation. Miss August definitely has the feathers. She has potential. She, she, she's glamorous. But there is a difference, they say, between how men and women treat pinups of the opposite sex. Girls are less visual, so they go, oh, I saw you in the calendar. They're really like, polite about it. Now, how would guys react to the girls? Like, like, oh, you look really good in that calendar. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I saw you the whole bubble thing. <laughs> You're out there, Miss December. <laughs> Come find me. Kathy Cronenberger, Fox 8 News. Now, by the way, the campus men calendar is not endorsed by OSU, but you can get a copy from their website at www.campusmen.com.